Welcome, Sussex Squadron. It's a fascinating thought, isn't it? What happens when the domain name for a prominent brand gets acquired by an unknown entity? Allow me to illuminate you with a recent chain of events. Imagine this scenario. Meghan Markle, our beloved Duchess of Sussex, is on the brink of launching her brand new project, American Riviera Orchard. The hard work is being put in and the strategy is forming. However, an unanticipated twist occurs. A mysterious individual purchases the UK domain name for American Riviera Orchard and redirects it to the Trussell Trust, an anti-poverty charity. As word of this unexpected acquisition spread, people started visiting the redirected site. And the result was truly astounding. Over £8,300 were raised for the Trussell Trust. The incident also sparked mixed responses about Meghan and Prince Harry contributing to an ongoing dialogue. This intriguing tale serves as a reminder of the importance of securing domain names, well as igniting a discussion about the allegations of opulence surrounding the Sussexes. More on that later. For now, let's appreciate the serendipitous event this purchase created. It was indeed unpredictable. Also, let's extend a warm welcome to our new member channel, The Sussex Family TV. Show some appreciation by subscribing and sharing their content. As Lawrence Bett, I invite you to this unexpected journey. Who could have guessed such an outcome? But here's where the story takes an interesting twist. As it turns out, the Trussell Trust, the charity to which the domain was redirected, was equally surprised by this unexpected turn of events. They confirmed they had no hand in this unusual situation, but here's the interesting part. They decided to accept the donations anyway. Now, let's pause for a moment to understand the Trussell Trust. It's a UK-based organisation that fights hunger and poverty, a cause that resonates with many. So when this website, intended for the promotion of a high-end brand, suddenly starts redirecting to a charity combating poverty, it's bound to raise eyebrows. But instead of getting lost in the confusion, some donors saw this as an opportunity. They chose to view the redirection of the domain to the charity as a positive move. Some even left comments about Meghan and Prince Harry on the fundraising page. It was as if this unexpected twist had turned into a unique platform for expressing support and admiration for the Duchess and her husband. But let's not forget about the Trussell Trust in all of this. Despite being brought into the situation unintentionally, they handled it with grace and acceptance. Instead of shying away from the unexpected attention, they embraced it, accepting the donations and continuing their mission to fight poverty. To think that all of this originated from an unexpected domain purchase. This incident not only underscores the importance of securing domain names, but also highlights how even in the most unusual circumstances, a positive outcome can emerge. Who would have thought that an unexpected purchase could lead to such an interesting outcome? It's a reminder that sometimes, even in the world of domain names and high-profile individuals, there's room for a little charity and a lot of positivity. This isn't the first time high-profile individuals have faced such issues. Indeed, the history of cyber-squatting is littered with tales of opportunists snapping up domain names with the hopes of turning a quick profit. Take the Sussexes, for example. Before the American Riviera Orchard incident, they had a run-in with cyber-squatting issues with their Archerwell Foundation. It seems that no matter how high one's profile, the internet can still be a wild west of sorts. But what exactly is cyber-squatting? In the simplest terms, it's the act of registering, selling or using a domain name with the intent of profiting from someone else's trademark. It's a sneaky way to ride on the coattails of another's success, often causing confusion and loss of revenue. Imagine launching a brand, only to find out that someone else owns the digital real estate associated with your name. It can be a nightmare, especially in our digital age where a significant part of brand identity resides online. Now, let's rewind to the 90s. The term cyber-squatting originated during this time, when the internet was still in its infancy. People began to realize the potential value of domain names and started buying up URLs related to well-known brands and celebrities. Some would then try to sell these domain names back to the rightful owners at inflated prices. It was the wild west of the web and anyone was fair game. 
Fast forward to today, cyber squatting has become a critical issue, especially for high profile individuals and organizations. It's not just about losing money, it's about protecting one's identity and reputation online. The incident with the Sussexes and the American Riviera Orchard is a stark reminder of this. It underscores the need for thorough domain name protection. It's not enough to have a great idea or a well-known name. You have to secure your digital presence too. The importance of thorough domain name protection cannot be overstated, especially for high-profile individuals like Meghan Markle. So what does this all mean and why is it so important? This incident is a clear reminder of the critical importance of domain security. In the world where online presence is paramount, securing your domain name is as crucial as securing your physical property. Imagine you're launching a brand just like Meghan Markle's American Riviera Orchard. You've put considerable time and resources into your brand, creating a unique identity that resonates with your target audience. Now imagine someone else snapping up your domain name before you do. They could redirect it anywhere, to a competitor, a charity, or even a site that damages your reputation. This is exactly what happened here, underlining the importance of securing your domain name early in the brand development process. Not securing your domain name can have serious implications. It can confuse your audience, lead to lost sales or donations, and even tarnish your brand's reputation. The internet is the first place people go to learn about a brand or individual, and your domain name is often their first impression. If that introduction is compromised, it can be challenging to regain trust and credibility. Moreover, the incident brings to light the concept of cyber squatting, where individuals purchase and hold on to domain names with the intent of selling them at inflated prices. It's a digital form of extortion that can cost companies thousands, if not millions, to reclaim their digital real estate. In the case of American Riviera Orchard, the redirection to a charity may have been seen as a positive move by some, but it could have easily gone another way. This incident serves as a stark reminder that domain security is not something to be taken lightly. Whether you're a high-profile individual like Meghan Markle, a small business owner, or anyone looking to establish an online presence, Securing your domain name should be a top priority. In the digital age, securing your domain name is just as important as securing your physical property. After all, your domain name is more than just an address on the internet. It's an extension of your brand, your identity, and in some cases, your legacy. In a strange turn of events, this incident has resulted in a wave of positivity. An unexpected twist that has taken us all by surprise. This seemingly trivial incident of domain purchase and redirection has sparked a public reaction that no one saw coming. It has driven attention to an important cause, the Trussell Trust, an organisation committed to ending poverty in the UK. The internet has once again shown us that it can turn the most unexpected events into opportunities for goodwill and charity. The public's response to this incident has been overwhelmingly positive. The fact that the redirected domain ended up generating funds for an anti-poverty charity has been seen as a beneficial outcome of an otherwise unfortunate situation. Donors have left comments about Meghan and Prince Harry on the fundraising page, showing their support for the Duchess and her endeavours. The incident has indeed drawn attention to the importance of securing domain names, especially for high-profile individuals and businesses. But it has also highlighted how the online community can turn a potential negative into a positive. The redirected domain has not only raised funds for a worthy cause, but has also sparked conversations about the importance of charity and giving back to the community. The incident, which initially seemed like an attempt to undermine Meghan Markle's new brand, has instead resulted in a wave of support and positivity. The unexpected funds raised for the Trussell Trust are a testament to the power of the online community and its ability to rally behind a worthy cause, even in the face of adversity. While the story began with an unexpected domain purchase, it ended with a reminder of the power of positivity and the importance of securing your online presence. The domain redirection may have been an unexpected twist, but it has resulted in a positive outcome and a valuable lesson for us all. So, as we move forward, 
Let's remember the importance of securing our digital footprints and the power of the internet in turning unexpected events into opportunities for good.